To say times are challenging is an understatement. One in five adults in the U.S. experience mental illness in the average year. And now, one in three adults report experiencing symptoms of anxiety or depression. I recently was on the news talking to the executive director of NAMI. Here's more. Patty, you know, how did you come about getting a chance to know each other? Well, uh, when I had to quit due to my hearing loss, uh, 2004, 2005 uh, officially, um, I was very depressed because my life was changing dramatically. Oh, yeah. And I had to do it. Uh, then I got, you know, dogs and cats, and that helped me to get through it. But I was so depressed. I was so happy to know that there's something out there, mm. National Alliance on Mental Illness, to help people. So I want to advocate for that. And, and, <laughs> and Julie's <laughs> here to tell us more about it. With the pandemic, we have a lot of empathy mm -hmm. because everybody's going through something. Julie. Yes, we are all going through the same storm but we're all in different boats. Wow. And yeah, and so NAMI is, we are dedicated to improving the lives of persons and families affected by mental illness through education, support, and advocacy. And we are a coalition of uh, volunteers with a lived experience of either having a mental health condition or having a family member with a mental health condition. And so we bring power and strength to communities by sharing our own experiences and letting people know that they're not alone. You know, that's so powerful because so many people, especially from generation to generation, sometimes they've told themselves that they don't need to talk about it. But right. in reality, we all need to talk about yeah. it because yeah. it's something that you have to kind of hit head on, wouldn't you say? That's right, that's right. And if you don't talk about it and if you don't open up to those around you, then you're at risk for um, having a mental health crisis. And that is not something that you want to experience and you don't want your loved one to experience. And if you want to be connected to NAMI and be connected to people that understand what you're going through, mm -hmm. you can go to our website, namiindy.org and all of our contact information, our programs, our support groups are all listed there. Mm -hmm. And we are here for you and we're here to help. Thank you so much. For more information or to get help, go to namiindiana.org. We'll be back with more on Great Day TV.